What's going on guys? We're here checking out another property that I think I might pick up. So we have a cameraman behind it. Say hi. What's going on? He's gonna be giving some commentary as well. So follow me guys. We're gonna check out this new property. How much do you think this house costs? I think it's like 769,000. Like just under a mil? Yeah. It could be a million. And also I do wanna say, you guys showed so much love on the other house tour videos that we did. I'll put those in the comments down below. Let's check out this house. So this is a new build. As you can see, it's full of construction out here. Now, what part of town are we in for those watching? Let this us know. This is the northeast part. I'll follow you in, go ahead. This is the northeast part of the Woodlands, Texas. Northeast part of, we're in the Woodlands? Yeah. Oh my God. And look, we got a three car garage right over here. There's one garage here and then there's- One gar a three car, car garage? garage? right here, so it's okay. three. You got the double glass doors. Double glass doors, bro. Let's go. All right, let's see if the lighting works in here. Oh yeah, there. Oh, oh, we have light. Okay, follow me. I have a lot to say. Whoa. So, this house is a mess. Let's get into this. Ooh, look at this. Look at that. The stairway looks pretty nice. Let's come over to the kitchen. Let's see if this is uh, this lights up over here. We're gonna look at the finishings. Yeah. So it seems like like a common trend that houses have this right here. It's like where you put boots and stuff like that. I would really like. That's for the fridge. Yeah, well, you know, I, let me dream. Because when I buy it, it can be whatever I want it to be. For the fridge. Yeah. <laughs> out here, you can see the lake view. We have a straight up lake view. Check this out, guys. It's a premium lot. I honestly would, if, if we can let the builders know, if they can just build like this glass. I just want one giant glass right here. Yeah. See, you look, know? it's right here. They're going to put the sliders in. Yep. Here's the lake. Now, it's not one of those properties where you can park your yacht and then get in it and drive into the shopping part of the town. I'm not that rich yet, so this is all I can afford right here. So I'm pretty sure I'll be fighting off the ducks because you know they're going to become pooping everywhere. I mean, it's a nice view, but at the same time, the ducks, they're going to start coming. They're going to come through knee. the little fence over yeah. here and poop on your porch. And listen, listen I'm going to be honest with you guys. I already don't like it, and I'm going to tell you why. Okay. If my mom was here or my dad, the first thing they would say is that these houses, although they're beautiful, they're just too close together. If one of them catches fire, this whole neighborhood is going to be on fire. They're so close to each other. But I will say, I like how it's not um, like a fake house where you see the brick in the front and in the back, but the side is like that fake plastic wood thing. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Like it is wood all the way around. So I do like that. And bricks. You look pretty yeah. Good. I'm sorry. It's bricks all over. Well, I don't know if you can see. If you can zoom in into the lake, there's like a mist coming off of it. Do you see that? Yeah. Look, look. I'm going to kind of zoom in for you. See the, like, just hold it right there. See the little mist? Wow. There you go. All right. Let's check out this thing. So you guys, please leave a like on this video. It is freezing. How about, what, how cold is it? I think today? it's like 30, 29 degrees. <sighs> oh, look, there's a fireplace. <laughs> Ooh, it's cold. Okay. Okay, look, so look what they did too. They put blue by the island. What do you mean blue by the island? Like the blue cabinets. That's blue? That's blue. I must be colorblind because I think it's like a dark black. No, that's a well, deep wh blue. Well, why are you saying like, are you just saying because you like navy blue? No, I do like it, but that's a trend I've seen in like a lot of new houses is like they'll do white, you know, when it comes to cabinets, but then they'll have pops of like blue to complement the white, you know, countertop. Yeah. I mean, it's just very like, it's like they're making it very neutral. This is very K-Cash. Yeah. But you know, once I move into it, it's gonna be total pink Candyland fantasy. But look, so right up top, you got the little two things with the glass. You could put all- Hardly your fit anything in there. Yeah, well, due to my, my awards. Oh, I do wanna say this. I got a new bag. Check it out. I'm gonna show you what I keep inside of it. All right, here we go. So. I can, <laughs> hold on, Louis Vuitton haul. Okay, we have some little Omega-3 mix. You just gotta have one of these, you never know. I got my little gloves, you know. I got, oh, it's for the demons, you never know. You know what I'm saying? Espiritu Santos, you know, all the little demons get away. For those who don't know, it's a cross. Okay, 
and I also have um, a cam. This is the camera I use, and I'll link it down below in the description. This is a really good camera. I mainly use this for all my videos, but off the fly, I'll just use my iPhone. And then I have two gloves right here. Oops. And then one last thing is a little Jeffree Star lip gloss. Not sponsored, although I should be. Okay, so that's what's in the bag. All right. So let's go on with this tour. Where do you want to go? Oh, yo, check out the sink. They see the water work. Wait, hold on. You know, no, you go on that side. It's fine. So check this out. But keep it on me because I look good today. You know what I'm saying? Make me look skinny. A little higher, please. Thank you so much. Okay, so. See, look, the blue right here. I told <laughs> it's you. It's a blue. No, but does the water turn on? Try it. This water pressure, though. <laughs> is it a, what is that brand? Kohler or Kohler. Cool, cooler? Kohler? Kohler or is it, it's Moen. <gasps> it's, a hey, Moen's a good brand. Okay, let's see. Oh, look no, at no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. The cabinets, let's see, does it have that soft close? Look what they have right here. There is a signature on a cabinet. Okay, here we go. Ready? I'm gonna do a soft close. Look, here we go. <gasps> yeah, did you catch that? It's a soft close. Yes, I love that. I love that. Okay, let's see what we got over here. Okay, so these are your little books, a little See, that's nook. where you put all your shoes and stuff. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Oh, is this the, what do they call it? Primary? This is the butler's pantry. Butler's pantry? Kind of small. This is where they cook all the stuff or get things ready mm -hmm. for the main event. Check this out. Yeah, go ahead, go ahead. And there's the pantry right here too. What? What is that? That's the two car garage. I don't know, the Rolls Royce will fit in there. And then this is the laundry room over here. Oh, I love that. You know why? Because it's just like you just put all the clothes in there. And then you just tell, you know, you know, like a like a like an intern or something, you're like, here, <laughs> this is what you gotta do. Organize this. Look, I really like that. That's a whole nother room. That's part yeah, of the Yeah, but you kitchen. can see your neighbors from here. Come Who on. Cares? Who cares? Me. You're in the woodlands. It's we're not some and like in some forest with, that's not inhabited by people. Like there's people who live here. Okay, this is the primary. No way, this is it. You got lake there's no drama. You got lake views from your primary. But you know what it's missing? It's missing a fountain spewing out water like the Bellagio at the fountain. Yeah. You know? Like if it if it had the you know, just look, imagine guys, imagine you're here. You just got through making love to your lover and you're sitting here and for some reason you you have to like cock you like cock the leg up like this and then you're just like yeah whatever you know what i'm saying you would be nice if you had the fountain but you could pull it right here like in your backyard you could do add a little fountain. fountain yeah you got a little fountain hmm i'm already spending a million throwing a fountain damn Let's okay here we go oh my God. i have not seen this before in any other model this is different. Look. You're shook. Look at the tile. Are you shook? No, look, you're gonna be shook. Look at the tile. Okay, let's see how many guys I can fit in here. Okay. One NFL player. Okay. A basketball player, because look how high the ceiling is. Yeah. Very tall. Yeah. And then like maybe a baseball player here. So we got NFL, baseball, and basketball. A seat over there too. A seat for the elderly. If you have like a sugar daddy and he really can't, you know, he's always in a wheelchair, you can just prop him up right here. And he could just say, yeah, <laughs> turn around, baby. <laughs> you got the shower. But I will say this. I have to knock points because there is not a rainforest shower. Yeah, there's no rainfall. The shower rain, ahead. the rainfall. And, and a house like this should have rainfall. I agree. Because you have that here and then you just have that. So I'm going to go here. I'm going to turn on the water. Okay. Then I'm supposed to run over here to take the shower and then run back. <laughs> To turn it off, got a slip and fall right <laughs> here, girl. Fall. It's over. Oh, but show the bathtub. Okay, here we go. Is there water in there? Well, you know I'm gonna complain. So this this right here just needs to go. This is one one big window, and put a TV. <laughs> All right. Oh my God. Look at the marble countertop. It's Calcutta marble. Let me see, because some, some of these homes, people, let me see where we're at here. Some of these homes are fake because they have the fake marble. 
Like it looks like Marvel. You guys know what I'm talking about. And let me tell you what. And KCash, you know. And you know who they are too. And if you maybe you'll want to say it. But there's some builders, they don't really do they cut corners and then you're living with mold. They do the visual, yeah. I don't know. I don't know if this is marble. It looks it it looks like marble, but it it's feels cold. like plastic. No, but it's cold. If it's cold, it's marble. There's just things that you look at, and it, you know, it's no disrespect to anyone out there, but like once you've been in the game for so long, you start noticing that like, hey, like you start asking questions like, is this real marble? Um Let's do a mold inspection before I buy. There's still things like that. Like when you, some people, they walk in, they're like, oh, it's so beautiful. And you're just taken away by it. But then if you know, anything else you want to add to that? Yeah, like, just it's like the quality of like the fixtures, the craftsmanship, like how well is the tile cut? Like mm -hmm. you want to take a look if there's any like spaces like this right here. I mean, but also this is going to be challenging because you can see the waves, right? So but, so, but I get what you're saying. Okay, let's, let's travel on because you know, Daddy has a big closet. So check this out. This one has the nine foot doors. That's usually found in estates. Really big closet. Although I feel like it's nice there's towel in here. It's kind of cold. Like I feel like it needs a rug. Yeah. It's pretty cool. And look, and then you got the other side here too. I'm not mad at it. it I mean, could it be bigger? Yeah. But what I just don't like when they have the the commode. Is that what people call it? Commodes? Yeah, people call it commodes? Yeah. Or whatever, right here. And is it that Japanese one? No, the, with the Toto? You know what I'm talking about, the Toto ones? They ain't gonna put a Toto in here. Let's see, is it a Toto? Let me see. Wait, hold on. Listen, I'm that friend, and when I go to your house, I will look at the brand of the toilet. Okay, hold on. And then like, li 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 okay. Let's say I'm at your house. And you're like, Rich, are you okay? And you just come around the corner. Okay, go ahead. Okay. All right, I'm ready, go ahead. Rich, are you okay? Oh, oh, I see you have a Vorten. All right. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Like, like, like which is so weird. Like, this. hi, welcome to me. Yeah. It's a Vorten's Camo. Not, I'm really not that impressed by it, but whatever. Like, million dollars. Oh, look at the beans. You can't get a Toto with a million dollars. Okay. So, of course, every house has that little thing where people work at. No, no, like this that. is the media room right here. You could do yeah, like you a movie can theater. put like a golf course in there. Movie theater. Movie theater. And I come down. Hi, come on in. Come up. Let's see what we got going on over here. All right. No chandelier. Just bust at the house. Oh, look, you have a lovely view of your neighbor's roof. Hey. Give me a name. Give me a name. John. Hey, John. So I'm sitting here looking at your roof, right? You need to get a new roof replacement. Like, seriously, I would... <laughs> bro, what... <laughs> this is how close I am. But you do get a partial view of the lake, if that if if that matters. But, you know, hey, you need, you need to clean your gutters. <laughs> I can see it, John. <laughs> oh, my... What is this? It's like a little... It's where you have the, the sex swing. Or this is where you film your <laughs> YouTube videos. That's, that's, this is a very awkward room. Like it's. <laughs> that is for your imagination. Yeah, whatever you want to put in there. Let's see. Oh my God. Do we. Is this where they keep the Toto? No. You guys, if you made it this far in the video, comment down below Toto. What's Look up? Look how cold it is in here. Yeah, it's really cold. Let's see what we got here. I mean, it's kind of like every now and then you'll have a builder that like will impress you, but then they do something to mess it all up, you know? So then you have another view of your um, neighbor's roof, right? And actually you can see it. Look, I can see three different residences, just one, two, and the one in the back, just from right here. It's just too close for me. It's just, I don't know. How do you guys feel about that? I don't know. Am I am I picky? But it's the thing is, guys, like if you're not picky, you get picked up. So just just keep that in mind. Mm-hmm. Let me see. What's over here? Is this where they keep the toto? Let's see. Alright. Oh. What do you think? 
I don't like the tile, but it's nice that it's a big shower. Uh, I guess that's a closet? Yeah, so this is like a little ensuite. Okay. So this has its own room, its own closet, its own bathroom. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right. Ray, uh, come on. I know you have a lot to say. What do you, you're not, are you impressed or you, you can care less? I mean, honestly, like it's a nice house, but I just feel like for the price, they could put a little bit more special touches let into me, it. Let me say this. Coming from where I came from, dirt poor and working hard to get to where I'm at today, this is a nice house. Mother effers would kill to live in a house like this. It's a nice house. But when you've been there on the board a couple times, you're just like, nah. You know, you just kind of, you kind of like, yeah. First time house, first time person, they're, they'll be shook, right? But um, when it's like your second or third house or an investment property, you're just kind of like, mm. You expect a little bit more drama. Oh, look at that. They got a light right there by the stair. That's nice. But you know what? You can also buy that on Tamu. <laughs> <laughs> on on the wish link is down below <laughs> on wish you know how that is that you can just like right. you just sticks on there with some 3m tape and you're ready to go kind of like my veneers <laughs> okay coming down here i saw that there was a little room over here yeah there's a study in the front restroom for the guest the study you think yeah bedroom this is a study because you got the This glass is like, doors. okay, you know what I think this room is? It's like, I don't know, like you could have it to be when people walk in. Y'all can just chill here. Like a lobby area. Yeah. Like a vestibule. Yeah. Oh, hold on. There's more over here. The, the house just keeps on going. It's just like chlamydia. It just keeps on going and giving. Oh, look, it's an ensuite. Because it has its own bathroom right there. Oh, the nip, the the lighting, the boob lighting. I hate, you know what I'm talking I hate the boob lights. I light. can't stand People, these. stop buying the boob lights. Like, stop buying that, okay? Stop. I have a lovely view of my neighbor's um, house again. I mean, look how close that is. Man. But think about this. If this house, you know, was on like one acre, it would be like three million. So, you know, it's less. And this is the one car garage because it's three. So you could like actually put this on like an Airbnb or something. Yeah, or you could do like a little crafts room. But I like how like you can park. It's this, okay, so there's a two car garage and then there's just the one car garage. So this part could be like for someone who like that's their room. Right. This is pretty cute. Or it could be like a, you know, same one for like a sports car. It's like you, like you stick the mother-in-law over here. Yeah. You don't want to see her, you know? Like this is like a little in-law suite. You don't want to see her and stuff. They got their own stuff She can do here. her, yeah. Yeah. Then she can come out and complain about something over here. Well, listen, let me get my Louis bag and then we'll go outside and we'll talk a little bit more about how the construction of this house is all wrong. So would you buy this house? No. Okay. No, it's giving like, it's giving like, because I would buy it. It's giving like first time homeowners on a budget. So? First yeah. time? Yeah, on a budget. Because of the quality of the build. I know you're mad, but you asked my opinion. I mean, I like it. it. This is why we're not together. This and that's not the only reason either, too. All right, let's let's get out. Let me let's show let's show the people. Okay. So obviously. This car garage is very small. Like, I don't think you could put a G wagon. That's in like there. a sports car. Yeah, it has to be like a real small, a real small car. Here's the outside. It's it's trying to give like Spanish kind of vibe. <laughs> like I'm at the Olive Garden, but like it doesn't know if you want to go to the Olive. It's like that girl who's like, "What do you want to eat?" And you're like, "Olive Garden." No, how about Mastro Steakhouse? And you're like, "Well, how about like Texas Roadhouse?" No, Applebee's. It's like this. That's what it's giving. This house is like that moment of indecision. Of like Barnhouse Chic <laughs> meets Taco Bell with a splash of cheesecake.
What do you think of that? It's nice. It's very clean, you know, white. Yeah. Fresh. I feel like I've been here before. Yeah. You sure we haven't been here before? Nope, nope. Maybe in a dream or something. Look, there's a little open, they have that little glass thing, but let's go back this way and explore those other nooks when, as soon as you walk in. Yeah. Um, oftentimes, I feel like they have like offices, like they want you to make it into an office. It's like they do things and people just pick up on it. So here we go. Boom. So this, obviously you have two rooms. So to the left and to the right. We're going to come in here. This to me, it's a, it gives off like a room. Yeah. You know, nice little closet. You got windows open. Nothing across the street yet. And uh, as you can see, you have, that's like pretty. What I like about this space so far, the closets look really big. But this seems to be a shared restroom Yeah. with this room here. You call it a Jack and Jill. So it's kind of like, I don't know, I, I guess like you have to, are you? I'm not a fan of I'm Jack not a fan Jill. of that because then it's kind of like, are you in there? Yeah, there's no privacy. Yeah, and they can, yeah, you have to like lock your door, whatever. So we're back in the main entrance right here. This is where it's at. All right, so we're back in the beginning. Then return here, what is this? So that was one, two rooms. This is the third one. This is the oh, third. This one has its own bathroom. That one has its own bathroom. Right? It's own closet. You go, like that. This is a really nice room. You know, sometimes this is pretty much all you need for a lot of people. And then over here. This will be the half bathroom. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, nice. like the guests. And the guests come over and want to powder their noses and stuff. Yep. All right, then. So that already was three rooms. And then here you this have- It's like a little office because the doors are glass or they should be glass. Would you turn it into an office? See, they're glass doors. Yeah. Yeah, this is a good office with like a media room. I just don't like the nipple light. I don't ever like the nipple light. What would you like? So you just put a desk here and you just sit here and Yeah, work. so what I'll do is I'll do like a nice big, you know, chandelier, put a desk right here exactly where you're standing and you know, make it white and gold and just very classy. And then back, oh, we'll get to that in a minute. So that's already- at least three bedrooms, yeah. and then you have like an office, which you, I guess, could turn into a room if you wanted to. And then you come over here, and then you have this huge kitchen. And then you said something, I guess, here. So over here, you're gonna have the two, <laughs> you know, wall ovens. Yeah. And this is called a butler's pantry. Oh, you're so you right. Have all the storage, this all is the a lot of stuff. Yeah. It's like almost like each house. This one seems like it's geared toward like cooking and kitchen. Yeah. Like, girl, Very Uber like eats the chef's, house. You know, chef's house. Yeah. Chef's <laughs> like, entertainer house. <laughs> like a little small one. And then I don't like that pillar that's dividing. Yeah. That right there, I would just knock this out. But check this more. out, though. This is like a space for like a formal dining room table, which is right off the kitchen. And what's that? That's like an area to put like plants, a piano, like a sunroom. What? Yeah. I would just knock this. Hear me out. I would knock this down. And it's this open concept. You can put a big table here. I like that idea. Even too. that, just put arcade room or something. It's all but arcade. Also see this ledge right here? Like people like to put like little vases. <laughs> Girl. Yes. Well, and then we okay, let's go to the patio. I'll follow you out. I'll probably, go ahead. I'll follow you out to the patio. Yeah, sure. Okay. This is like a family house. <laughs> mm-hmm. You get a lovely view of your neighbor's... Uh, little outdoor patio. Yeah, a lovely view of your neighbor's roof. You can let them know that they need to clean the but gutters. Look, right here, though, right here, the space, you put a hot tub. You could, but this here, too, like this, this, it, it's just built all wrong. This could have been one big sliding door. I agree, yeah. One, or one big giant window. Like, why would you do and that? And do, like, the whole concept of indoor-outdoor living. Exactly. All right, but this is a big, you know, nice room here. It's nice, but I feel like it's missing a fireplace here. Oh, you're right. I didn't think about that until you said it. All right, so this is the primary, I believe. But I know that you're going to love the closet. Okay, okay. Yeah, this is a big primary, yeah. Pretty cool. The closet, you're going to love the closet. So there's no lights in here, guys, so, you know, be cautious. So here would be the Kamo... This kind of reminds me of your restroom that you had yeah. and your house. Very it's kind similar. Of, it's yeah. kind of like that. Like the tub would go right here. Except your closet was not, not this. Yeah. this oh cool. my God. This is everything. How big this and is. A, and it wraps around here to the right. 
Yeah, I would have all my clothes. And then it wraps here this way. This is what, the washer and dryer area? Right, garage, yeah, there's a garage in there. I guess washer and dryer. And I guess this right here, you could put like a little coffee bar. If like you want it, yeah. For if your you want it. And then we're back here. We're back in the main area here. It, it seems bigger than what it is. Like, I'm almost thinking, like, is there an upstairs? How much? No, it's you, a one story. It's yeah. a one story house. So, old. Like, I think it's for like 700 something thousand. One, so you got three bedrooms over there and then four. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, four bedrooms, three full bathrooms and a half plus an office. I would just fill it up with just arcades and games and just like, like yeah. that could be that room over there could actually be the room full of all the video games, arcades, make it fun. Candyland theme. Everything will be pink. Yeah. Yeah. You know, that gets the whole vibe aesthetic. <laughs> That's just what I was thinking. But, you know, one often things I don't like is up there. Those little nooks. I was going to say, and that's too small. I feel like for the kitchen this big, you gotta have a bigger light. <laughs> yeah, you're right. You're right. Like that's definitely too small. a bigger light. That's like apartment light. Wow. Nothing here, and you're literally in the woods. Like if you look at this view back back here, guys, like you're gonna see. This is almost like the Jeffrey Star Ranch. Yeah, I'm in the, I'm in Wyoming in the ranch. You know. Okay, look, from here, it looks really big. It looks really big. Yeah. It's one of those houses that, like, once you start putting your stuff in it, it feels small. Yeah. And then you're like, I bought a house, but I already outgrew it. And see, to your point, it's because of stuff like this that makes it seem smaller once you put furniture in. Yeah, especially if you put, like, a big dining room table. I don't know. Because the thing is, like, most people just get stools and eat there. Right. Because you've had houses before, and, like... Do people really sit no, at the table? Everyone always comes to everyone the just islands hangs out in the right kitchen. Here. The table is just to like look good for like the holidays. Maybe have two times a year it gets used. Maybe, yeah. If that. So obviously I would just put like arcades. Yeah. And games and pool tables and stuff like that. Actually, that would be a good space for a pool table. Pool table, yeah, to have a great time. Let's and see. over here like a big, you know, corner couch, a huge TV on the wall. See right there where the little ceiling fan outlet is? I'll put like a huge, like, you know, castle style chandelier. Mm -hmm. You can make it custom. Definitely make it custom. Obviously. Okay. Well, let's go check out the outside and then I think we're, I think we're done here. Let me know, you guys, in the comments down below. What do you think about this house so far? And I know there's another house that we showed too. So let them know if you like this house or the other house better. Oh my God. Y'all are in for a treat. Because we're on a house hunting day. House hunting hall. Okay, look. Here we are. This is the outside of it. What do you think of that? Oh, it's so cold out here today. Okay, guys. We're going to wrap up the video. Let me know what you think of all that. And leave a snowflake emoji. Leave a snowflake emoji. You made this part. It's cold. Brr, bye.